The US Air Force's Sentinel drone isn't seen very often, and little is known about its characteristics. A handful of witnesses have spotted the unmanned aerial vehicle in the air since 2007 in Afghanistan. With the last sighting by an amateur aircraft enthusiast at the end of 2021. A product of the Hush Hush Lockheed Martin Skunk Works. The drone has maintained a low level of hype over the years. And that is what the Air Force wants. The ARC U-170 received the moniker, the Beast of Kandahar, for its missions over Afghanistan. That very nickname interesting. Let's take a closer look at this very mysterious aircraft. The stealth flying wing of ARC U-170 is 90 feet wide and 6 feet high. It is designated for intelligence, surveillance, and reconnaissance missions. The RQ-170 can also feed target acquisition data back to the home base and conduct electronic warfare operations. The RQ-170 is a high-altitude drone. Flying up to 50,000 feet, this makes it an important asset for the Air Force. It may have produced the video for the Osama bin Laden raid in 2011. The unmanned craft gives the Air Force another option. As more recon drones come online and the RQ-4 Global Hawk Intercontinental Spy Drone is retired. Thus, the Beast of Kandahar may become the Beast of East Asia in the future. RQ-170, last seen over Southern California. A civilian photographer grabbed a photo of what appeared to be the RQ-170 over the El Mirage Desert south of Edwards Air Force Base, California in December 2021.